Hey everyone, it's John with Seattle Coffee Gear. I'm here with a crew review of the new KM5 coffee grinder from Mocha Master. This is a completely new grinder for them. This is a 50 millimeter flat steel burr grinder, which is an upgrade over the previous model, which was a blade grinder. Why is that important? A burr grinder provides a lot better consistency. It gives you more even particle size, which lets water extract those tasty compounds from the coffee more evenly and giving you a consistent, better tasting cup of coffee. Let's talk about some of the design elements of this grinder. As you can see, it really matches the Technivore Mocha Master Brewers. It has the same rounded edges of the design, the same metal body, and some of those little design elements like kind of the stripes down the side of the grinder. You get an adjustment knob right here on the front of the grinder and a glass grounds bin. Now let's move on to the features. I just touched on that adjustment dial. It is a stepless dial and has a setting dedicated for Mocha Master Cone Brewers. Most of them that we've seen come preset out of the box at that number five setting, which is ideal for the Mocha Master Brewer. They added some anti-static tech to this grinder to help it be a little bit neater. We'll show you that in action just a little later. This grinder has decent capacities at about eight ounces for the hopper and about 100 grams for the grounds bin. To run the grinder, you're just using the on off switch on the face of the grinder. It is very manual, so you probably will need some way to measure your coffee, either by pre-weighing your beans and grinding the exact amount you need each time, or having a scale nearby to check your weight as you're grinding. The grounds bin also has some measurement lines to it, so if you took some time to get familiar with the grinder, you could use those measurement lines to get roughly the same amount of coffee each time. One last note on that grounds bin, it does come with two different lids. It has this lid, which has a little hole in the top, obviously for grounds to fall through. It also comes with a just completely flat lid that offers some sealing, so you could leave grounds in there and get a decent seal to help it stay a bit fresher. Now that we've talked about design and features, let's move on to some pros and cons. The biggest pro for me right up top is that build quality and the brand name. Mocha Master products are known to last a very long time and to have parts available for them for a long time in the future. If something breaks or just wears out, you know you can get parts to fix your products to keep them running for a very long time. Tied in with that pro is Mocha Master's five year warranty. I do not know of another grinder that has a five year warranty. That's definitely a pro. Another pro is the grind quality for drip brewing specifically. Like I said earlier, most cases we've seen, it actually comes preset for a Mocha Master brewer. So it'll produce great tasting coffee all the time. That moves us towards one of the cons. This is not going to be a very flexible grinder. If you want something for pour over, espresso, drip coffee, cold brew, you might want to look at something with step settings like a Barazza. Another con that's kind of a pro is the style of it. It's really only going to match Mocha Master Brewers. Luckily, there are a lot of dedicated fans to the Mocha Master brand, so I'm sure this grinder will find a happy home with many of our customers. The last con that I'll note is static. They do have some anti-static tech, but I've found it still is a bit messy. That's enough talking. Let's go ahead and brew some coffee. I have the Technivorm KBGV Select Brewer here. These are gonna pair perfect together. They even match. That brings us to the end of this review of the KM5 grinder from Mocha Master. Do you have thoughts on this grinder? 
drop a comment down below. If you enjoyed the video, we'd really appreciate if you liked it. If you're looking for a new grinder or other coffee equipment, subscribe to our channel and you'll be notified of when we post new videos and new content. Also be sure to follow us across all social media platforms, Instagram, YouTube, like you're already here. There's also a link in the description where you can sign up for our email newsletter. We'll let you know when there's new products, sales and promos, and you can stay up to speed on all things Seattle Coffee Gear. As a thank you for signing up, we'll also send you a coupon for 10% off one item. Exclusions apply to that code, so make sure to chat with our team with any questions you have about that. As always, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great rest of the day and keep making coffee you love.